Welcome to the technical studies. In this video, we will discuss about the common types of weld defects, causes of weld defects and preventing methods. Welding defects are imperfections that can compromise the strength, durability, and appearance of a welded joint. These defects can arise due to various factors such as improper technique, contamination, or unsuitable welding parameters. Below is an overview of common welding defects, their causes, and preventive measures. Porosity Porosity refers to small gas pockets trapped within the weld metal, leading to weakened joints. Causes Contaminants like moisture, oil, or rust on the base material. Using wet or low-quality electrodes. Inadequate shielding gas or improper gas flow. Prevention Clean the base material thoroughly before welding. Use dry electrodes and ensure proper gas shielding. Maintain appropriate arc length and travel speed. Undercut Undercut is a groove or depression at the weld toe or throat, reducing the cross-sectional thickness and strength of the weld. Causes Excessive welding current or speed. Incorrect electrode angle or arc length. Improper filler material or shielding gas. Prevention. Adjust welding parameters to suit the material thickness. Use the correct electrode size and angle. Ensure proper shielding gas coverage. Incomplete fusion. This defect occurs when the weld metal doesn't properly fuse with the base metal or between weld passes, leading to weak joints. Causes. Insufficient heat input or improper welding technique. Contaminated base material or electrode. Incorrect joint preparation or alignment. Prevention. Ensure adequate heat input and proper welding technique. Prepare and align joints correctly. Clean the base material and electrode before welding. Incomplete penetration. This defect arises when the weld metal does not extend through the entire joint thickness, compromising joint strength. Causes Excessive gap between workpieces Too rapid welding speed or low heat input Improper joint design or electrode size Prevention Ensure proper joint fit-up and alignment Adjust welding parameters to achieve full penetration Use appropriate electrode size and technique. Slag inclusion. Slag inclusion involves non-metallic particles trapped within the weld metal, weakening the joint. Causes. Inadequate cleaning between weld passes. Incorrect welding technique or speed. Improper shielding gas or electrode angle. Prevention. Clean the weld area between passes. 
Maintain proper welding technique and parameters. Ensure correct shielding gas coverage. Spatter. Spatter refers to small droplets of molten metal that solidify on the base material, affecting aesthetics and requiring additional cleaning. Causes. Incorrect welding parameters such as high voltage or current. Contaminated base material or electrode. Improper shielding gas or electrode angle. Prevention. Adjust welding parameters to optimal settings. Clean the base material and electrode before welding. Ensure proper shielding gas flow and electrode angle. Cracks. Cracks are fractures that can occur in the weld metal or base material, leading to joint failure. Causes. Excessive heat input or rapid cooling. Residual stresses or poor joint design. Hydrogen embrittlement or unsuitable filler material. Prevention. Control heat input and cooling rates. Design joints to minimize stress concentrations. Use appropriate filler materials and preheat post-weld heat treatment. Arc strike. An arc strike is an unintended contact between the welding electrode and the base metal outside the weld area, causing localized melting and rapid cooling. This can weaken the metal and create potential points of failure such as cracks. Causes. Accidental touching of the electrode to the base metal outside the weld zone. Starting the arc in the wrong location. Lack of experience or carelessness by the welder. Inadequate workpiece grounding can result in stray arcs. Unintended arcing can lead if it contacts metal surfaces. Prevention. Ensures correct arc starting and handling techniques. Directs arc starts away from the workpiece. Prevents stray current from faulty cables or holders. Avoids accidental contact by keeping the area organized and monitored. Use protective barriers or ceramic tapes to shield nearby base metal. Prevents arc wandering or unintended contact. Excess penetration. Excessive penetration in welding refers to the situation where the weld metal penetrates too deeply into the joint, potentially leading to structural weaknesses. Causes. Wide root gap, high welding current, slow travel speed, improper electrode size or type, incorrect welding technique. Prevention. Adjust the root gap, control heat input, optimize travel speed, select appropriate electrode, refine welding techniques. Lack of fusion. Incomplete fusion or lack of fusion occurs when the weld metal fails to fuse properly with the base metal ore between weld passes, leading to weak spots within the weld. Causes. Low heat input, improper welding techniques, contaminated surfaces, incorrect electrode size or type, poor joints are the causes. Prevention. Ensure proper joint preparation, select appropriate welding parameters, maintain proper electrode handling, control heat input, use suitable filler materials. Incomplete penetration. Incomplete penetration occurs when the weld metal does not fully penetrate the joint thickness, leaving an unfilled route, which can lead to weak spots and potential failure under stress. Causes. Insufficient welding current, excessive travel speed, improper joint geometry, 
incorrect electrode size or type, poor fit up. Prevention. Optimize joint design. Ensure proper bevel angles and root gaps to facilitate full penetration. Adjust welding parameters. Set appropriate welding current and travel speed to achieve desired penetration depth. Control heat input. Maintain consistent heat to promote uniform penetration. Root concavity. Root concavity, also known as suck back or underwashing, is a welding defect characterized by a depression or hollow area at the root of a weld joint. Causes Excessive root gap, high welding speed, incorrect welding techniques, too large root face. Adjust root gap Ensure the root gap is within the recommended range, typically 2 to 4 mm, to allow for proper penetration and fusion. Control welding speed, select appropriate root face. I hope we have covered most of the welding defects, causes, and remedies. By understanding the causes and implementing these preventive measures, welders can significantly reduce the occurrence of slag inclusions, leading to stronger and more reliable welds. Thank you.